Hey guys, welcome back. This is Cars and Cloud. In this video, I'm going to download Firefox for enterprise deployment and then create it in SCCM as a package. And after that, I'm going to deploy it to the desktops. So you can download the Firefox for enterprise deployment for free. When you, when you want to deploy to your enterprise, you want to make sure you download the enterprise, not the, not the personal use versions of Firefox. So to download the enterprise versions, you want to go to, um, let me paste this link here. It is www.mozilla.org slash en dash us slash Firefox slash enterprise. Once you're here, as you can see, it's enterprise. You want to click on download. There are Windows 64 bit, there's Mac OS, and there's Windows 32 bit. If you want to select 64 bit and deploy to your environment, you can select this one here. There's options for the MSI versions and the S, um, the EXE versions, and also the extended support release. I'm going to download the EXE versions. As you can see, it is downloading now. Let's finish. So the EXE has been downloaded. I'm going to copy it to my network share. It's going to be here under Firefox. I'm going to create a new folder called Firefox 75.0. That's the versions. I'm going to paste it here. So this is the enterprise versions. I also downloaded the personal versions. You don't really need it. I'm going to delete this personal versions. So now the EXE has downloaded. I'm going to create an SCCM applications or package. Let's go to configuration manager, go to software library, go to applications, right click, create applications. It's going to be an EXE, so you want to choose the, should be a script, uh, let's see here. Let's do a manual, click next. Call this Firefox 75.0. Publisher. I'm not going to fill out all these informations. You can if you want, but I'm, I'm going to skip that. Click Next. Firefox. That looks good. Deployment type. I'm going to click Add. Let's create a deployment type. It's going to be script installer so this is install Firefox that's what I call it language that's fine click next the content is where the exe is located installation programs I'm gonna browse to the exe oops Here it is. So I want to put in slash s. That means silent. You want to make sure you put in a slash s so the installation can be silent. The uninstall programs, you probably can add it later. Uh, this time I'm going to skip it. Click next. Add a class here, a detection method. I'm going to do a file system file, and the path is going to be percent sign program files 
percent sign slash Mozilla Firefox and the file name is firefox.exe so this location when I do percent sign program files that mean it's going to look in both places like the x64 and the and the regular 32-bit um, program files make sure you check this box and the file name it's going to be versions I'm going to put greater than or equals to the version is 75.0.0 you can um, verify the exe versions file versions and see what exactly it is greater than or equals to click next next it's going to be install for systems Logon requirement whether or not users log on installation program visibility normal you can allow user to view the interact or programs I you don't need to but um, you can if you want to just check this box the maximum allow I'm just gonna put 20 minutes estimate installation time and leave it zero Click next requirements if you have any requirements for this Firefox I don't click next dependency I don't have any dependency click next and next and close click next again confirm all right now I can distribute the contents right click on the package and then go to distribute contents click next contents confirm click next choose the DP click OK click next and summary page once the package has been distributed now I can deploy the package right click go to deploy I'm going to make it available for all device. I'm not going to push it, but make it available in Software Center. Click Next. As you can see here, available. Click Next. And Next. You can skip all these. All right, now I can go to my test machine and see if I can deploy or install the software from Software Center I'm going to force the policy so it's going to check in for any new requests or new policy let's go to Software Center Here it is, as you can see, Firefox. Oh, not that one. Let's refresh. This is the removal, it's not the one I just created. Let's force the policy again. All right, now Firefox is available. I'm going to click on it and then click on install. It's downloading. Now it is installing. As you can see, the, um, the icon has been created. 
the installations uh, still ongoing. So that's it. That's how you create an EXE um, using Configuration Manager or create a package in Configuration Manager and um, deploy the, um, the enterprise version of Firefox. Thank you for watching. I hope you have a great day. Thank you. Bye.